Liz Diller. I'm one of the founding partners of Diller, Scofidio and Renfro, and we're the architects of the Broad Museum in Los Angeles. The Broad is a museum of post-war and contemporary art collected by Eli and Edie Broad. What we wanted to do was make a very porous facade to make a connection between the street and the museum. You know, so it's a two-way system you could see in and museum goers could see out. It comprises 2,500 fiberglass reinforced concrete panels made from 380 distinct molds. They're shaped using parametric software to enable light to come in in a diffuse way into the galleries. It doesn't really feel like a traditional museum. There's no sense of authority. When you step off the street, no one tells you where to go. There's no information desk. There's no admissions desk. You don't pay, it's free. It feels extremely welcoming. The Broad comprises two main components, what we call the veil and the vault. The vault is effectively the collection of the family and it's situated in the center of the building. It hovers over the lobby and on top of the vault is a giant gallery. The veil covers the building uh, on all sides and it allows light to come into the galleries. Once one enters, you're really underneath the vault and you feel the heaviness of this floor. When you leave, you take a stair through and you actually see what's in the vault. I love the brutality of concrete. I love the rawness and the refined aspects. There's a lot to do with thinking about the carbon footprint of concrete and finding new systems, new products, aggregates, and just allowing concrete to be just more sustainable.